At 11 p.m., Israeli soldiers raided a small Bedouin village in the area of Azor and Helgala in the east of Jericho. Here they destroyed six farmers' outhouses, which the villagers depend on for their livestock. They came at 11 p.m. and they destroyed the houses. They warned us, but they are doing this because we are building new houses. They wanted to destroy our work. The Bedouins explained to Press TV how difficult life has become in a closed military zone. We have lived in the area for 30 years. We made new outhouses, but the Israelis destroyed them because they wanted to build a security area. But we have lived here for 30 years. Look around you. We can't live with our animals here. We have no choice. We can't live in an enclosed area. The soldiers furthermore attacked the residents on site. They attacked us and our children without us knowing why. They didn't give us time to empty the outhouses. The children cried and were scared at worst because it's winter and it's cold. There is no reason for them to do this. Israelis are now stepping up their policy of occupying villages, towns and cities in various regions in order to eliminate the achievements of the Palestinian people. They have also stepped up their procedures of demolishing homes and continued violence towards the Palestinian people. As you can see from the destruction around me, the Israeli soldiers stormed this village at 11 o'clock in the evening, destroying six of these outhouses. This is just part of an aggressive Israeli land grab, particularly in the Jordan Valley region. Nell Burden, Press TV, Occupied Jericho.